I want you to know, friends, I don't know how you feel. I want you to know, the world of my proud of you. The world of, I'm glad that I'm part of this holy people. Not that we are so holy that believe in God, that's also very special. But the world, we are carrying the torch of humanity. Do you know in the world that it like kill six million Jews? Because the world is not human. The world is not human. I mean, individuals are politics, the world of politics as a whole doesn't have one ounce of human feeling. Let me ask you something, forgetting about the Jews. Do you think really that all those millions of people all over the world have to die from hunger? There is enough food for the world. Only the politicians, for them, they make money on people starving. Imagine if the world would get together and say, okay, let's feed, forget about the adults, feed all the children of the world. I tell you something which I'll never forget. <laughs> During the Sixth Day War, it was unbelievable. During the Sixth Day War, you know, there were little high school kids who volunteered in the hospital. And I tell you something, the Arabs who were wounded, where do you think they put them when they were wounded? You think they put them some in a prison hospital? They were lying next to these raided soldiers. They had an even better treatment. Anyway, listen to me. I'm coming into this hospital, and a little girl of 16 says to me, I want you to know, I'm taking care of this Arab soldier. He's 17 years old. He lost his foot, and he's so sad. Can you please go up and talk to him in speak English and uh, sing him a song? I'm going up. It's heartbreak, a boy of 17. What do they want of him? Anyway, I, I talked to him and I sang him a few English songs, a Hebrew song. And then, after the girl did this, she says to me, Can you please come with me to, to the seventh floor? The seventh floor are the people who are dying. She says to me, You know something? My boyfriend is up there, he's dying. Let me ask you something. This girl should be so angry at the air. Say, what's going on? You're killing my boyfriend. I spit at you. Damn you all. And the first thing she asked me to take care of this air blue boy. I want you to know there's one thing about the Jews. We have no hatred. You know, friends, where do you think is headquarters for peace? Not Rome, not Washington. Jerusalem is the headquarters of peace. God has chosen this city. And one day, one day the whole world will come. And let it be soon. Thank you so much.